my lovelies and welcome back to my channel so today i have a very laid back and lounge fly haul so if you guys are interested then just keep on watching but before we begin let me remind you that subscribing is 100 percent free so please click that subscribe button and while you're at it go ahead and click that notification bell so that you're notified every time that i post i post every single week so trust me you don't want to miss out Alrighty, with that said let's move on to the haul i feel like i have been doing lounge fly hauls like two by two i don't know i'm like the Noah of lounge flies. <laughs> just, every time I, I feel like I have to get two lounge flies at a time. I, I can't just get one and be satisfied. Nope. So today I have two lounge flies is what I'm trying to get at. I have two lounge flies to share with you guys. I don't know which one to share first. All right, let's just go with the one that I was most excited for and yet a little bit disappointed. Mercari. Mercari. Oh my gosh. Enough said. Anyways. Um... If you saw one of my previous launch fly hauls, you saw my holy grail uh, backpack. Like to me, that was the best backpack they've ever created. And to this day, it's still my favorite launch fly. Um, I will link all those videos down below for you guys, of course, but it was the iridescent um, pink launch fly backpack. And then I saw that they had a yellow version and I talked myself out of it so many times. But then I had to have it. I just had to. And so I got her. <laughs> oh, she's gorgeous. Oh my goodness. I just love this iridescent combo with the sequins. It's, please make more of this. I mean, this is spectacular. I love it. And um, I still like the pink one better. I do, but I'm so glad I have this in my collection. Oh my gosh, no regrets. No regrets at all. But I did get it off of Mercari. And I actually heard that um, Shop Disney brought this backpack back onto the website. I don't know if it's still there. I have no idea. I didn't even, I, I didn't go to check because I knew I would get upset. <laughs> but, and I heard that originally these were like 110 in the parks, but then they were selling it on Shop Disney for like 80 bucks or something like that. I don't even know. I don't know what's going on there. I wish I had waited because, um, but I didn't think that they would bring this back because the pink one I was waiting for them to bring it back on Shop Disney, they never did. And so I was like, okay, there's no use waiting because they'll, they won't bring this back. And sure enough, they did. <laughs> but anyways, so I got this off of Mercari again. And, um, but the girl that I bought this off of, I mean, she was pretty nice about it. She said that there were some obvious defects on the bag. She like had pictures and said that there was like a dent on the back here somewhere. I mean, you can't even see it first of all. It's, it's up against your back. Like I, I didn't care about that. And then she said like the sequin ears, there's like some sequins that are flying off, which I mean, it's sequins, of course it's gonna do that. But the most obvious defect that she failed to mention was this. You can see like a little dip right here. I don't know if you can see that. All right, again, very hard to notice unless you're like looking at the backpack and inspecting it. But I wish she had mentioned that, you know, but I actually got it cheaper than what it was selling for, like brand new. So that's why I was like, this has to be too good to be true. What is going on? But she said it was because of the defects. Like, she actually, like, technically lost money from selling it to me, which was weird. But anyways, so I went for it. And I'm glad, I mean, I'm glad, I'm glad I did. Okay, I'm, I'm glad. But I still, I don't know, I wish you had mentioned this. Because this is the most obvious defect, and uh, that was, um, she literally noted the little dent on the back and all this, but she didn't say this, this. And, like, when you um, look at it up close, it's like it bulges outwards. I don't know how to show you guys. It's like picking up all of the sequins and everything. So my camera's a little, like struggling a little bit, but you can clearly see that, right? But either way, I still love her. So gorgeous. Oh my gosh, like I said, this combo with the hollow and the sequins, this is the best, absolute best. I like it more than like the all sequin backpacks, which which is what I'm going to be sharing with you next, but let's get into the backpack. Oh my gosh, I'm just rambling. Anyways, so there are side pockets on either side. There's a front pocket. Uh, the plaque is right here. This is what the inside lining looks like. It's that blue with Mickey Mouse. 
And um, I don't know, it reminds me a lot of like a, a Snow White or a, a Belle, like Beauty and the Beast, you know, with the yellow and the blue. So I feel like if you do Disney bound as either of them, you could definitely uh, use this. You know what I mean? The colors, they just work. Anyways, this is the first one. Uh, the second one I got is sequin, all sequin. And it is this beauty right here. Even though I like the hollow with the sequin, um, I just thought this was beautiful. Like, look how beautiful. I love this, like, bright magenta, shiny, metallic. Oh, it's it's gorgeous. And I saw that there was a different version. Um, I got this off of a new website, actually. 707 Street or something like that. I don't know. I have no idea about their return policies. Up until now, I've been only buying from Mercari and um, Madbagger, which they are, like, they're legit. They're a Loungefly seller. And I know that they give you like a refund if you're not pleased with your purchase or give you store credit or something like that. Uh, I have no idea about 707, I don't know, but I saw this and I was like, ah, yeah, I'm definitely going to be keeping this. I'm not gonna be re refunding this or needing a refund for this. So um, uh, that is why. And I would have bought it off of Madbagger, but they didn't have this. So, or at least I didn't see it on there. Otherwise I definitely would have bought it off of Madbagger, but cause I have the app. I have the Mad Bagger app. I know, I know. Who has a, a Loungefly app? I do. Uh, anyways, so she's gorgeous. Um, she again has two side pockets, front pocket. There's the plaque right there. And then this is what well, the inside looks like. It's just polka dots. But she's beautiful. And... Uh, and I have found out that I have a thing for lounge flies with the ears. I love when the backpacks have these ears. I think it's so cute. I don't know. Like I'm automatically attracted to the backpack when they have these little ears. Um, but I'm keeping the protectors on them because apparently they end up like drooping after a while. Uh, this one unfortunately did not come up, uh, come with a protector, but these are doing pretty good. I think this is still available on 707. Um, I do have a discount code for Madbagger and a link uh, if you want to check them out. And I may have a discount code for 707 Street. I have no idea. Either way, I, like always, I will include it, uh, the information on the screen as well as uh, in the description box below. So if you want to save some bucks, check those out, the discount codes. But <sighs> she's gorgeous and I love her. <sighs> So I'm very, very happy with my purchases. I have bought like a Loungefly backpack almost every month, uh, every couple of weeks if you count like, you know, that I buy like two by two. But uh, um, yes, I do have another Loungefly haul coming up for you guys. Uh, when those backpacks come in, I will of course share with you. And I need to figure out, I think I figured out a way on how I want to display all of them but I will keep you guys posted because I am doing kind of like a room makeover, which is taking way longer than I expected. Um, yeah, but that's a whole nother story. Anyways, stay tuned for all of that. It'll all be on my um, YouTube channel, of course, and on Instagram and on um, maybe even TikTok. I don't know. Just go ahead and follow me on all of those platforms. Just, you know, just cover your bases. You might as well. <sighs> Anyways, so that is it for this little laid back lounge fly haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Give this video a big thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.